So our school has been experimenting with different ways that kids can access information and also share their learning. And one of the things we've done um, a few years ago was Google Hangouts, where the kids took virtual field trips via Google Hangouts to the Big Island. We connected with classes in Mexico and uh, in Honolulu. And now we're branching out to try other things. We use Twitter to connect with classrooms, and students uh, even write blogs to share their learning. Today, we're going to use the Periscope app, which is usually for social media, but we're using it to connect with experts in the field. Today, we're connecting with the Army's Natural Resource Program, and uh, because of the terrain and the location of where they are, um, we're not able to take our 125 fourth graders. So Periscope allows our kids to ask the ex experts questions and to see the plants that they're planting and to see the actual invasive species close up via Periscope without paying for a field trip, getting on the bus and going there. So it's an exciting new use of social media to connect kids with experts. The kids are really excited to connect via social media because they're so familiar with social media and they're watching you know, their favorite YouTubers and DIY um, folks online. But the challenge for us as educators is how do we personalize it? And so with Periscope, it lets the kids type in their own questions to the experts and it gives it that personal touch. So this quarter we're actually studying about native plants and animals from Hawaii. And so having the new technology allows us to bring it to real life for the students. It's hard for us to get to certain places, especially being on Skofa Barracks. You know, some are on island, some are off island. So it brings it more real life for them so they can experience what we're talking about in the lessons and bring it to life for them. I hope that the students learn about our native plants and I was Hawaii. They're 90% military students here, or actually more than that. But from this experience, hopefully they can learn more about our islands, the native plants and animals, things that, you know, what we do affects our islands and the plants and animals of Hawaii. So hopefully they can gain an understanding and just be better taking care of our islands. So.